Hi everyone, how are you doing? This is Dr. Hashem Jamal. I'm an ENT consultant at Burjil Day Surgery Center. This morning, I'm going to explain to my colleagues, both uh, nurses and physicians, how to do the proper uh, nasopharyngeal swab specimen. And this specimen is very important to take it from the nasopharynx so that we'll get a, a reliable result with no negative, uh, false negative testing. Okay, so we'll start with the uh, nasopharyngeal swab. So um, it's very important to know that the nose, the direction of the nasopharynx goes this way and not up, not this way. It's very important. That's, that's why when we want to direct our um, Q-tip or a cotton bud, we have to direct it to the nasopharynx all the way to the back. So this is the, uh, the Q-tip for the, the, for the specimen taking and the, the direction has to be, I'm privileged to be having a nasal speculum. Nasal speculum will allow me to see the front of the septum and then, the, and then the floor of the nose, and this swab should be going right along the nasal septum, along the floor, all the way to the back. You turn it when you reach, when you hit uh, the nasal pharynx, you turn it for, um, you know, to get a better sample, and then you go out. This is the proper way of doing it. If you go in, and then you go this way up, for example, like this, improper way, if I go like this, up, it's improper, it's not good. Therefore, the direction is all the way to the back. Now, I demonstrated to you how to take the uh, proper sample of nasopharyngeal swab. We as physicians need to get the best samples from the nasopharynx and uh, to ensure the best result for our patients. And in that way, we will all be uh, fighting the COVID-19 pandemic. Thank you very much and have a great day.